Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. My name is Asad Yaqub and I'm from Lahore, Pakistan and I teach IELTS here in Lahore. I welcome you once again in my IELTS uh, listening video. So welcome to IELTS listening video by Asad Yaqub and in this video I'm going to solve section 2 of a test and the question types we've got they are sentence completion and there is a map. Now many of you have said this to me several times on several occasions that maps are difficult to understand. So those of you who've got issues with the map now let's solve the issues. So let's take this test. I will read the questions then I'll play the audio. We'll take the test together and then afterwards I'll give you my feedback on that. Okay let's take a start. Okay now let's see the questions. 11. The land for development has not been used for over a over a means time period so there's going to be the time period here there was pressure to build a training center and a a is very important here a means it's going to be a singular noun whatever it is going to be right so it's going to be a singular noun on the land next uh, sponsorship has been received from a number of they received sponsorship from where from where did they receive the sponsorship number of dash number of for number of they can use the word like many various and all that so we are going to see what is that from where did they receive it then we've got questions 14 to 20 right uh, and here the most important thing is you got to see where is the first question this is 14 so audio will start from somewhere here and it's the name of the street after that you got to go on with the audio wherever audio takes you you've got to just go on with that see that it's 14 this is main entrance and this is question number 15 now it's not 15 block it's question number 15 so from main entrance you will come in and there is educational center and then question number 15 block of something after this they will take you back here and then they are going to take you to question number 16 then they will take you to 17 after that they will come to 18 and then 19 so for map it's very important you should know the arrangement of questions very very carefully then you can just do it secondly you need to be familiar with prepositions this is corner and all that stuff right so now i'm going to play the audio and we can solve this test together right section two you will hear a talk by a councillor on plans for the development of an old industrial site. First, you have some time to look at questions 11 to 13. Now listen carefully and answer questions 11 to 13. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Councillor Norma Boyd and welcome to this exhibition about the development of the old paper mill factory and gasworks site which has been lying unused for more than a decade. There has been pressure on the council to use the land to build a training center and a small business park. However, we have been encouraged by local people to create an open area for the benefit of the community, providing much needed space for recreation. And I now have pleasure in announcing that the plans for the creation of a park, to be called Park Royal, and for flats have now been approved. I'm also pleased to announce that we have secured sponsorship from local organizations. More detailed plans of the developments are available from the council website, details of which are in your pack. In the meantime, I'd just like to take you through the plan here on the screen. Before you hear the rest of the talk, you have some time to look at questions 14 to 20. Now listen carefully and answer questions 14 to 20. If we start here at the bottom, you can see Parkside Street, where the main entrance to the park is. On the left of the entrance, in the bottom left-hand corner of the plan, there will be a block of 40 studio flats. On the other side of the entrance, there will be some workshops for local businesses. There will also be another entrance here on the top right which leads into Pear Street. Here in the center of the park we will have an ornamental lake with paths radiating north, south, east and west 
to the different areas of the park. In the top right-hand corner, just by the Pear Street entrance, there will be a large sports area with two football pitches and four tennis and volleyball courts. Just here, beside the pitches, on the same side of the path, will be an outdoor swimming pool. Now, in the top left-hand corner, a walled flower garden is planned with a rockery and a water feature with walkways, seats and lots of shady areas for the summer. Next to this, a sculpture garden is also planned. Now, let's see. Just here, below the walled garden, there will be a grassy amphitheatre with a permanent covered stage for open-air concerts. We hope that local schools and colleges will use this theatre to showcase student work. In the bottom left-hand corner of the plan, you can see that above the block of flats, there will be a play area for children. And directly to the right of this, just near the main entrance, there will be a wild area. More trees will be planted here, and in the middle, will be built an educational centre for use by local schools to encourage children to take care of the wildlife and look after the trees and plants. And finally, in the bottom right-hand corner of the park will be a cafe, opening on to Pear Street. And now for questions. If anyone would like to ask anything, I and my colleagues are only too happy to oblige. Yes, the lady in the front row, if I could have your... Okay, so how was that, huh? Good one. See, section two is a little more difficult than section one, but still you can overcome that. And now you are very well aware of uh, sentence completion and map. Remember, in map, all you need to do is you need to learn prepositions, prepositions of place, prepositions of location, uh, then phrases to give way, to tell way, all right? So once you learn all these things, it's going to be easier for you. If you like this video, hit on the like button and don't forget to subscribe my channel, Asad Yaqub. I also run two other channels, Asad Yaqub Vlogs and Asad Yaqub Languages. You can subscribe my other two channels as well. And I also teach IELTS online if you want to join Join my online IELTS classes, you can contact me for that. Asad Yaakov wishes you all the best. Take good care of yourselves. Bye-bye and don't forget to watch the next video. See ya!